This place brings back a lot of memories. Great memories that stem from terrible ones. Women and children forced to flee domestic violence used to call this place home. So many names, so many faces, so many stories. Today, places like this aren't needed. It was an intense struggle, but we brought an end to domestic violence. This could be our destiny. This could be our future, but the future is never certain. What will you do to ensure a peaceful world? An estimated 1.3 million women are victims of physical assault each year. In the United States, a woman is beaten every nine seconds. Abuse causes so many problems. You remain a, a voiceless person within a very serious situation. I was involved in a domestic violence relationship for a little bit over eight years. It didn't stop even with the divorce. It escalated and my 26-year-old son, he killed my ex-husband. I felt hopeless and helpless. He became a different person. He, he became angry, possessive, controlling, evil, violent monster. Love should not have to be painful. Sometimes you have to leave to send the message that it's not okay. If we did not have domestic violence, we would not have broken homes. If I were a legislator to make a law, I would say no disrespecting friends, family, or teachers. The actual events that led me to come to the Women's Center uh, was that I was in a very abusive relationship, um, decided I wanted to end it, didn't want my family to have to um, housed me during that time, so I sought out shelter. I came to Women's Resource Center for Services um, because I needed help. Women's Resource Center gave me the light in the end of the tunnel. For the past 25 years, the Women's Resource Center to End Domestic Violence has partnered with thousands of women to break free from domestic violence. With support groups, an array of programs, resources, food and shelter, the Women's Resource Center supports women to recover, rebuild, and gain the hope needed to become survivors. The Women's Resource Center really made a difference. The first thing that the staff was able to help me do was just relax and be at ease. Um, the staff were, they were warm, they were friendly. Um, more importantly than that, they understood my situation. Um, they did not seem to judge me, and that was very important uh, for me at that point in my life. And um, more importantly than that, they gave me a very comfortable living environment uh, and a lot of support. Uh, through seminars and workshops. Um, I didn't know a lot about domestic violence when I arrived, but felt real empowered to go out and not keep repeating the cycle. I came to the legal clinic where they voted for my case, they took my case, and they got me divorced. I got my freedom. I'm really thankful for that. If we didn't have domestic violence, we wouldn't have so many empty souls. 
If we did not have domestic violence, kids would be safe. It's not just the issue of what's happening to the spouse, it's the issue of what's happening to the children and whether the children grow up and continue in that pattern. And even if they don't continue in an abusive pattern, they still will have the scars. And how many generations do they need to be passed down? I think a world without domestic violence would give an enormous opportunity for children to be raised in a peaceful environment, to be loved and to be nurtured. I think it would be wonderful opportunity for spouses to nurture and care for each other. I think if there were no domestic violence at all, um, that love could be the celebration that it's designed to be. If we did not have domestic violence, the world would be a better place. I feel very grateful for the opportunity I had to restore myself and rebuild my life. I see the world without domestic violence as a beautiful place where a, a man and a woman are two equal partners seeking happiness and peace, aiming to truly understand and meet each other's essential needs for love, support, respect and freedom. Ensure our future. Ensure our future. Ensure our future. Ensure our future. This is my home. A home to make new memories. Today we need places like this more than ever. This is my story. What will it be in the future? Please, give today to the Women's Resource Center to End Domestic Violence and ensure the future for someone in need.